So the other day I had a lady come into the store and you already know we're not going to call her the K-word, but she was a very, very entitled person. And dude, in the end, you don't want to miss what she ended up telling me. But before we get there, please make sure you subscribe to the channel. It really helps us out a lot. So this lady walked into the store and just started off by grabbing a couple bags of chips. And then I came out from the back and I was like, oh, hello, ma'am. How are you doing today? No response. So I was like, okay, it's going to be one of these types of customers. And then I tried in my nicest voice to say, would you like anything else or just the chips for a day? And she says to me, I will tell you when I'm ready. And I'm like, okay, so I'm just gonna stand here. You let me know whenever you're ready to make a sandwich, okay? And she kind of like scoffed at me. And so finally, after getting like four bags of chips, she comes over to where the sandwich place is and she starts ordering her sandwich. I start off by asking her what type of bread she wants and she tells me Italian bread. And then I grab the Italian bread and she goes, no, that is not the bread that I want. I want garlic bread. And I said, we don't have garlic bread, ma'am, but I have Italian herbs and cheese bread. And then I showed that to her and she was like, oh, okay, that works, that works. And then she ordered herself a cold cut combo. Now this wasn't any cold cut combo. She gave me very specific instructions as to how to make this sandwich. She first asked me to put the cheese onto the bread, which I said okay to. And then I put the cold cuts onto it. And then she starts screaming, no, no, no. I want you to toast the sandwich first. No meat onto it. And then we're going to do everything. And I go, you know, whatever you say, ma'am, whatever you say. And then I toasted the sandwich, took it out of the toaster. And she goes, you know, that's a little too crispy for my liking. And I'm like, ma'am, you should have told me so. I would have made it lightly toasted or something. I don't know. So at this point, I'm just trying to get through the sandwich because this seems like one of the those customers that is literally gonna complain about everything I do. And so I put the cold cuts onto the sandwich and then we start going to the vegetables. She starts off by saying lettuce. I put a mountain of lettuce onto it for her because she said extra, extra lettuce. And then I put some tomatoes onto it and I put five tomatoes and oh my God, this lady lost it. She said every other subway that I go to, they put six tomatoes, put six tomatoes. And I'm like, okay, ma'am, I will do that just for you. So I put the six tomatoes onto it. And I, you know, we always put five tomatoes. Like I guess other subways put six, but like, I don't know, it just seems like too many tomatoes to me who cares though and then i finally get through making her sandwich and then i put some mayonnaise onto the sub and she legitimately freaks out at how much mayo i put onto it she goes you put too much mayo onto this sandwich i don't want it anymore and i said to her well i could always just like scrape some mayo off of the sandwich and she was like you know that's just not the same and i was like ma'am i'm just gonna scrape the mayo off of the sub and you tell me if this looks bad and i scrape it off and she said oh well i guess that works then okay and so at the end i go to ring her up and then she goes wait 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 and as i was ringing her up she said i wanted soda you didn't charge me for soda and i was like you know you're a good samaritan for telling me that because you probably would have grabbed the soda Soda and I wouldn't even notice. So she went to the fridge and grabbed herself a couple sodas. And as I was ringing her up, she was like, you know what? I changed my mind. And she put the sodas back into the fridge. And I was like, when will this end? And that was about that. She took her sandwiches. She left the store and I went to the back and I immediately had to do some heavy breathing for a few minutes to recover. If that woman's out there, I'm sure you didn't mean to be a uh, entitled person, but you know, you're kind of a K word. I'm not going to lie. If you enjoyed this video, make sure you like it and subscribe to me. Subscribe to the channel. It's completely free. Listen, you beautiful and blessed person have a great day and remember eat fresh